Welcome to the Maths Made Easy tutorial on collecting like terms. This is the second video on this topic, so if you've not seen the first one, I recommend you watch that first because we go through the basics in that video. But here we're just going to look at a couple more skills, starting with expressions where we have like terms with different letters. So we have to simplify this expression here, which is xy plus y plus 2xy. So what are the like terms in this uh, expression? I'm going to reorder them, uh, the expression, so you can see. So we have 2xy plus xy plus y. Now I'm using a different colour here to distinguish between the like terms. Uh, so what are the like terms? Obviously we've got two terms in xy here. So we have a 2xy and a 1xy, or just xy. So xy we treat as one variable here, and y is a separate variable. So to simplify this expression, we just add the terms in xy together, which gives us 3xy plus y. So that is the simplified form of the expression. So moving on to a more complicated example now, this time we're identifying like terms where we have powers uh, in our variables. So we have to simplify this expression, we have 2x squared y plus xy squared plus 3x squared y plus 5xy squared. So again, I'm going to use different colours to distinguish between the like terms here. So we have a 2x squared y and we have a 3x squared y. So in this case, x squared y is one variable or one term and then uh, the other terms will be the xy squared and the 5xy squared. So here there are different variables at x squared y and xy squared. So we have to treat these separately. Uh, so uh, when we simplify this expression, we're just going to add these terms together. They're in different colours. So we have 5x squared y, so 2x squared y plus 3x squared y. And we have x squared, uh, sorry, xy squared plus 5xy squared gives us 6xy squared in total. Collecting like terms is a skill that's crucial to algebra, so it's important that you get a lot of practice. You can do so with our online exam. This is available through our revision platform. If you take the test, you'll find loads of different questions to have a go at, and all of which are instantly marked. So this is a really good way of keeping track of your progress, finding out where you're going wrong and how you can improve. So if you're interested, you can click the link below and it will take you straight there.